Hi, this is Gary DeBach of Puyallup, Washington, USA. I'm here at my favorite de-expedition spot. This is the Rockwork Ocean Cliff, although um, in October here, Asian reception is the um, main activity for all West Coast DXers. So uh, this de-expedition here in October was pretty much a all-out experiment to try to investigate whether this Rockwork 2 ocean cliff um, on the coast here near Manzanita, Oregon would be competitive for Asian, Asian reception. It does face the westerly direction and I had a lot of uh, practice in chasing South Pacific DX on the Rockwork 4 ocean cliff which is just over there in the uh, background. So I wanted to give this a try and see what the Asian reception would be. Uh, my wife was with me on this trip, so I couldn't really take along so much gear. I have a couple of 6-inch New Design uh, ferrite sleeve loop, loop antennas, FSLs. They have both performed very, very well so far. Um, I've been extremely fortunate to have good weather for three of the days here in October. Because here on the ocean cliff, you never really know uh, what you're going to have and weather can turn very nasty without much notice. But anyway, let me give you a rundown of uh, this site. Rockwork 2 is probably the largest of all of the Rockwork uh, ocean cliff turnoffs. This does have enough space here if someone was motivated to quickly set up a uh, quite large broadband loop. Uh, it has the awesome cliff in back of it, which uh, does tend to enhance transoceanic propagation. And here in October, my humble setup is a couple of supercharged uh, portables. This one here that I'm taking video of is the XH Data D808 with a 7.5 inch loop stick. And next to it is the 6 inch FSL, which has been waterproofed. Um, this is a new design. I have two of them. And the other portable is. 7.5-inch loop stick C-Crane Skywave basic model. These two have performed superbly, uh, although uh, it's certainly not the modest radios or the modest FSL antennas which have provided such great Asian reception here. It's all due to the cliff, and I've been extremely fortunate to discover that this cliff enhances Asian signals just like its sister site over there, Rockwork 4, enhances South Pacific signals. Uh, so far this very basic gear has uh, received stations like 576 Myanmar. Uh, it's received its parallel on 594 Myanmar. Uh, all kinds of stations from China, Japan, Korea, and so forth, which are fairly routine on the West Coast. But what is not routine is to receive stations like uh, Myanmar 576 and 594 with a 6-inch antenna. So you know this cliff has something serious going for it in the way of Asian propagation. The trick is to tolerate and uh, survive the fall weather which here at the uh, Rockwork Ocean Cliff can become quite enhanced. This is a highly exposed position, uh, very, very high up over the ocean. And it has a view similar to Rockwork 4, which is I think about 500 feet away or so. Gorgeous view of the city of Manzanita where my wife and I are staying uh, for this five-day vacation. 
and it's a perfect place to come and relax if you just want to enjoy life and get away from high pressure. So anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this simple explanation. We have a beautiful ocean this morning, and you can't really ask for much better weather than this in the middle of October, or propagation. Somehow both of them worked out to be fantastic, and I'm not complaining at all. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.